what's going on guys to War Champion Plays here and welcome back to another episode of Persona 5 Royal and today guys where we left off in the last episode of Persona 5 Royal we met Dr. Maruki and also we met Mr. Yusuke Katagawa and and I'm pretty sure in this episode we are going to the art museum for that event and also I'm gonna try to hang out of on in the as much as possible in this episode. If you guys are cool and down with that, everybody get ready to buckle up, cause here we go. Okay, I don't think we gotta say anything to Sergio. Um, I think we just ought to go upstairs, kinda move, maybe work on my proficiency. Okay. Because I kinda, I don't know, I kinda feel like it. I feel, I just feel like it. Uh, maybe craft. One for now, I guess. <clears throat> and we got a smoke screen. And we and we can make a common aroma. Yeah. Let's make it. Let's make it take it. Alright. I don't know if you guys can hear me well, but um Okay, do we wanna stop um Actually, we'll make more. Yeah, yeah I just kind of want to make more. Smart baby boy. I'm, I'm, I'm sorry, what? Uh, <laughs> yeah. Anyways, we increase our proficiency. And I think we will sleep. Whoa. Well, actually, I'm not going to make a translation on that. Uh, okay, nothing much really going on. Um... Yeah, just everybody talking their jibber jabber and shit. So not really much going on here. Okay, here we are. Hmm. Yes, yeah, so you might want to get back in that bag, Morgana. You. You came. And what you want? What you expect when you left us those tickets? Exactly. Make sure that you don't get in the way of the other visitors. Come on, I'll show you around. I'd like to speak more about the picture. I'd like to draw too. Well, see you guys later. Hey, we got dragged into this, <laughs> so <laughs> I won't lie. Simp. I told you not to come out. Get your best back in there, Morgana. Are we really gonna appreciate the fine arts? Can we just go home? Mm, maybe we should then look at them. Well, we did come all this way and stuff. True. Uh which way are we supposed to start? Don't play dumbass with me, Ryuji. That old man from the other day. Yeah. We continue to be truly surprised by your imagination. You have such expansive styles. It's hard to believe that it all stems from one person. Where in the world does all your inspiration come from? <laughs> I wanted to make a joke right there, but I'm not gonna say it. They're people watching champion. <laughs> I mean children, but still. Oh, this is a new story, huh? Oh yeah, I'm, by the way guys, I'm actually 
approaching my 400 video on the channels. All right, you should probably shut the fuck up. Bam, does his dick still like peaches? <laughs> Bam! Bam! Really? He's special. Nah, that nigga built different because I can't draw for shit. <laughs> like, I kid you not, I cannot draw. Let me shut up. Ah, the girl from yesterday. Are you enjoying the exhibit? I don't know how to put it into words, but it's really amazing. We're sensing something from the artwork. That alone is enough to give us all this satisfaction. I mean, it doesn't sound like a bad man. I hope this becomes a wonderful piece of skin. Well then, if you'll excuse me. He doesn't seem like a bad guy. Yeah, he doesn't seem bad at all. Indeed. It's called Happy Little Mistakes. <laughs> That's what his mom told him. Oh my fucking god. I'm such a fucking dick. I'm sorry, guys. What? Don't mind me. There are better pieces than this one. Come down. This way. Okay, pushing your ego a bit too far are they, Yusuke. Hey. Yeah, and you leave on in the dust. Where? What? About what? Well, get to it. It's about a post online. Mm-hmm. Look at this. Why'd you leave without me? Uh, because we want to. You got it all wrong. We got dragged into this huge crowd and... and anyways, you gotta look at this too. This post might be about Monorama. Mm-hmm. Wait, what 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 wait, what what post? Did this nigga get caught in 4K? <laughs> A master of the Japanese arts is plagiarizing his people's work. Only his public face is shown on TV. Uh-huh. Plagiarizing? Oh. I didn't think much of it when I first saw it, but hearing Shaq and Madarama triggered him. His treatment of the pupils who live with him is awful. He teaches nothing and bosses them around. He treats them inhumanely, as if disciplining a dog. Oh. Abuse on top of plagiarism, huh? Eh? Uh oh, I guess I was wrong. If this is I don't think it was him. I mean, he is a pupil of his. It could be that guy that we went from Mementos to. That could be the guy that posted it. Who knows? It's an honest <sighs> Yeah. In that case, it's possible the Madarame we heard about in Mementos is referring to the same one. Chances. Chances are. I'm like that doing such a thing? Yeah, for real. Shadow from earlier about this. Oh, actually, we just need to talk to him in reality. 
Go thinking. How are we gonna go about that? We're gonna explain it all, start with mementos. Besides, if we make a move out in the open, there's the possibility that Madarama will find out. So we're going to do this off the grid. <clears throat> So we need to do this off the grid. grid. Shut up, cock and I'm I need to start doing the accents. Yeah, right. Hey, what do you think about Madarame? Does he seem so I'm sorry for that edit. I I I, I know the <laughs> I hate I the meme's dead. All right. I I I I I know. I just can't resist. I just can't resist for saying so. Um. I don't really know. I mean, pretty much. Yeah, well-known artist. Oh yeah, but is it really true? By the way, what did you do about the whole model? Kitato Akun gave me his contact info. Nice. Like, oh my god. This is why Anna's one of the best girls in this game. This chick is smart as fuck, I, I, I'll tell you. And the address to his sensei's atelier. He said he lives there, right? Perfect timing. Let's try going tomorrow. We're off to Madarame's house right after school. Jeez. Can you want me to model tomorrow? I mean, sure. I mean, really. Oh, that's what you meant. Uh huh. I think we'll move after that. Okay. All right. In case we need to find out that rumor about Amarama is true, Whoa. and I give a damn hey. about that. What are you thinking? We have. Hey. Uh. Oh, wanna. I don't wanna sleep. Uh, what if I don't wanna sleep, Morgana? Uh, here, let's just watch TV, you rich crud movie ass. Uh, here's what we got for you today. Huh, there's a zombie channel that everybody's been talking about. Yada yada yada. I don't care. 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 Stop! I don't care. I don't care. I don't care. I, don't care. I genuinely don't care. Like, 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 is the plan okay? Yes, I think I should plant a plant. <sighs> and I should increase my kindness. I don't care about the freaking little TV bullshit. Sorry, but I'm going to bed, Morgana. Yes, we are going to bed. We fucking move. For the love of God, I don't want to hear about that little choppy channel everybody's been talking about. Shut up. Oh, Dr. Maruki. What's up, my boy? Thanks to the school. I could talk to you even outside of Castling now. I want to talk a little about your mental health and perception that can affect you. Don't worry, I won't stress you out or anything. Just relax and listen. How much do you guys know about emotional mind? See, what's going on in your mind can affect your body pretty significantly. There's proof of it that you, you, you can even heal depending on your luck, outlook. So matters. Oh, uh, what, what, what? Yes. Give me my fucking snacks. I hate those answers to this fucking question. I thought you gave me my fucking snacks. Um, um. What do you do when you call the phenomenon? Where believe in this treatment power is, a, is in enough proof to cure your condition? Um. I, I think you're questioning the one guy here. Like, you see. I'm literally the smartest guy in class. Like, you think that's Cap. You might as well just shut the fuck up and get out of my house. Like, literally, legit, get the fuck out of my house. Cause you think I'm really a dumbass? Like, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Like, yo, 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 my boy, relax. My brain is like Einstein. My brain is like, uh, an Olympian god. It's built different. It's 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 severely 
built different. Like, come on, mate. Like, come on, come on. Like, you, like, you can't be serious. It's the placebo effect. Like, come on, man. Stop playing with me. That's right. Yep, that's correct. Some people who satisfy the plebos don't actually have the creative properties. Even though the medicine does nothing chemically, it can affect your perception and help you feel better. On the other hand, if you don't trust the medicine to begin with, it might just make you feel worse. We call that the Nachibo. Oh my god, he got that shit right. He's too fucking smart. Please level up. Bruh. Huh. That's just one example. But my point is, my our minds and body are more connected than we think. So it's important, it's important to not push yourself too hard. And remember, your mind needs to rest too. And it's my job to help you do that. So come by to the nurse's office whenever you're feeling down. Mm. Uh, the mind affects the body, huh? Huh. <laughs> You think I changed something about them? I'm not gonna answer that question. We move. We move on. I'm not. Stop asking dumb questions, Morgana. Stop asking me and saying dumb shit towards me. Like, please. Like, chill. Like, literally. Fucking kill. Translation. Man thieves going by train. This is any different from how I get home from school, you know? Shut the fuck up. The train is the fastest way to go. Plus, we can bring pets on here. Hey, who are you calling a pet? You, nigga. Be quiet. We pay the pet there. I'm the one guiding you to your destination. You should be calling me master. <laughs> you really want to test that alpha male? Just saying. Oh, huh? You f mm. uh, it's a stuffed animal. Yeah, it's just a toy. It meows when you press on its head. You heard her? Press on its head? Yep. This is ridiculous. Shut the fuck up. Shut the fuck up. <laughs> F first, press F first, that's from Morgana. Smash that. <laughs> oh my god. Shut the fuck up. Shut the fuck up, bitch. Yep. Well, see you later. Bye-bye. Uh -huh. Also, where are your parents? <laughs> Just saying. So, which line do we got to transfer to? Oh, uh, no genius. There are any stations close by to that address. If anything, this is the closest station. What? We gotta walk the rest of the way? Too lazy, Ryuji. What kind of phantom thief takes the train and then walks to their destination? We live in an urban area. We live in an urban area. Of course they're gonna walk. Right. Looks like the fastest route is to get to the station square and then go to Central Street. I guess we might as well go past Central Street. Um, um, um this is supposed to be the re residential area past Central Street. We'll have to walk a bit. Okay. Let 
Jin Academy. Seems doubtful. Perhaps I'll have something. Just in case. Am I just my cut out? I'm not gonna question it. No one sneeze or we'll blow this house down, okay? Who is it? Sensei is currently. Um, it's Takamaki. I'll be right out. Damn. <laughs> He's like, I'll be right out. I will be out. I'm totally, I'm totally not in love with you. <laughs> Sorry, I'm putting my phone on the charger. You two are here as well. Got a problem? Hey. Sorry, but uh, we ain't here to talk about the modeling thing. There's something we gotta ask us. Yeah. Uh, is it true Monorama is plagiarizing stuff? He's abusing people too, yeah? Yeah. Are you oh. serious? Um, I don't know how much we Ryuji smelt. We read about it online. The fix? Preposterous! I can just literally think of the edit in my head right now. Tavoris, do it. Do, do that. Do it. Do it. He welcomes pupils into his own home. This is no act of violence. It is charity. And I'm the one residing here and studying under him. I'm saying it's not true. So it's beyond doubt. You might be lying about it. That... Mm -hmm. uh, I yeah, yeah, kind of slipped up. That is utter rubbish. Mm, you kind of studied there, buddy. I had no family when Sensei took me in and raised me into what you see now. What? I mean, I mean you're a fucking skinny bitch. <laughs> so. If you continue to ridicule the man I owe my life to, you will rue this day. You really think that? You scared. Oh, Malarame, what's up, my guy? <clears throat> oh, the fucking dick! These people are slandering you with baseless rumors. Forgive them, Yusuke. They must have heard some bad rumors and came in worried for their friend's safety. I mean... Are we friends? Are we really? I mean, you want to hang out outside, Yusuke? Well, you know, I doubt that a cranky old man like myself could be liked by everyone. True. That's not what we meant. I'm sorry to have butt in on your conversation. However, I do have neighbors around. Don't you please keep it down? True. So you might want to get off your high horse, Yusuke. Now, if you'll excuse me. Yep. This is discourteous of me. I'm sorry. I know. I think you'll be able to believe in Sensei if you saw that painting. My painting? It's his maiden work, as well as his most representative piece. It's titled Sayuri. Sayuri? Ooh. This was the painting that inspired me to become an artist. So is that the Mona Lisa in the Persona 5 universe? Yeah, I'm just asking. I 
with the same powerful emotion as when I saw this painting. Me? I wish to pursue beauty like this. You know there's a cat that literally steps for her, right? I believe drawing you will be part of that pursuit. I implore you, seriously consider my offer. No. I'm sorry that you took the time to come all this way, but I must assist Sensei today. I hope that we can discuss this further another time. If you'll excuse me. Those two seem like nice guys, don't they? Facts. Maybe the Motorama we heard about in Mementos is a different person. Man, I only thought we found a new target, too. For real. How's the metamath? Uh oh. Was it picking up our conversation? This display. It means that Matarame has a palace too, right? But why? We're not going in yet. Please. Matarame, plagiarism, and then Shatkum. These seem to be the keywords. For real, though, what the hell's going on? Does an old man like him really have a palace? Yeah, for real. We have the person's name and the location. All that's left is the what that Madarame mistakes the shack for to enter his palace. You mean like how Kamoshida thought the school was his castle? Ding 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 ding. That's right. Let's try saying some things. They can be random guesses. It's a bit sudden though. Yeah, for real. Why don't we start with the castle? Then what about prison? Huh. Also, wait, 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 prison, prison, also, prison, that's her fucking sequel, Ryuji. <laughs> the first word, your sequel. A museum, dumb, dumb, stupid O. Uh oh. Oh, uh oh. Are we jumping it? Uh oh. We're jumping into a palace. Oh. Get moving. So extravagant to the point that it's gaudy. It's a museum, right? Yeah. This is not a romance. Well, a palace is a world formed by a mind twisted by desire. Remember Kamoshida's castle? Madarame's artwork is on display at museums in reality too, though. Yeah. This exhibit was popular and people already respect him. Why would he fantasize about an museum? For real. Got a point. Not related to plagiarism or abuse either. Yeah. Let's try looking around. Racking our brains here won't do us any good. Right. That aside, ain't a museum a must for phantom thieves? Yeah. I guess this is where I re begin our infiltration. 
I guess we're gonna have to walk a gigantic line. Don't be stupid. We're going in the front door. Uh, the high hall around the thing. All right. Yep. Let's go. And we unlock the new palace just like that, lads. All right. This is really how he thinks is the round ass shag. Seems overly shine shiny. Uh, it's just hitting me. This is the old guy's palace. Uh, that's why we're here. Let's go check it out. Yep, we go. Alright. Alright, we go. And well, let's see. And let's grab this. Wait, can I, can I jump on this? Yep, I can. Uh, here we go. And let it boom, bam, bop, bada, bop, boom, grab this. And wait, there's a shadow right down there. Okay. And just gonna climb up here. And come on. And let's grab this. And let's go down. Oh, there's a skylight open. Huh. I think we can get in from here. Looks like a pretty far drop. I'm sure we'll be able to get back. Uh, don't worry. I have a rope. It's our. I'm not too special in it. Should we head inside? Yes, sir. All right. Huh, it's crying in here. Almost eerie, so... Hey, this. It's moving. Huh. We're in the powers, so don't be freaking over, freaking out over anything. Hmm. This is... Hmm. The palace reflects the Willis heart. You may have to check out the paintings. Um, okay, I'm gonna just grab this. And... Let's see. Oh hey, huh? There's some some kind of explaining. Let me see, huh? It's someone's name and age. What the hell? Huh? Can't be the title of the painting, right? Do you think the is this the artist's name? Hmm. Let's check the other paintings. I think they might be someone important here. Hey hey. All right, and I guess we gotta go in here. Hmm. Let's see about this one. Hmm. Let's see about. Hmm. Let's see about. Let's see about this one. Huh. They all look similar, even now the composition. Hmm. That seems pretty sus. I won't lie. That seems pretty sus. Yeah. All the portraits on display here look the same. This is way different from what was at the... Wait a sec. Ain't this that guy we saw in the Mentos? You know, the, the one who was shit talking about Arame? Yeah. Tsuniko Nakanova. His name's written on the plaque. Dude, I don't get it. Why is there a painting of him in here? Huh. Why is his name written under it? You're right. Doesn't art usually have, like, the title of the piece or the artist's name? Yeah, for real. Hmm, this is quite the mystery. I'm liking it. Alright, let's keep looking around for now. Alright, so let's keep looking for around. Um, let's see. Um, here's, yeah, yeah, this is all getting creepy. I know that Ryuji. No, that's Yusuke. Hey, isn't this a painting of that guy? Yeah. It says Yusuke Kitagawa. There's no mistaking it. Huh? Wait a second. What do you think these paintings are? Hmm. Modern Modern makes poop pupils. I think you're right. Yeah. All of them? But it was only Yusuke when we went to his place before. 
This must include former pupils as well. Only one remains now. Yeah. Taking into account what that Nakanohara guy said earlier, things are getting clearer. Yeah. Right, let's keep investigating. We need something to further confirm our deductions. Yep. And I think we keep on chugging from here. And I think we found a map. Yes, we do. Huh, there's some brochure over there. Huh, you found something? We have to investigate, so we should take everything out that catches our attention. Yep. Huh, is that a pamphlet? Huh, this is getting way too Tito for our freaking palace. Why does he bother making something like this? Huh, there's a museum guide on here. Let's take it. Ah, uh, maybe it shows the location of the treasure. If that's a possibility, at least it'll be a good reference place to for the scale. Of, yep. But the map only shows half of it. Uh, I I see. It's only is one one or out of two. All right. We can worry about that another time. I checked it right now to confirm Madarame's carnation. We may have to reconsider our plan, depending on what we find here. I mean, it's got a problem. Palace. That seems pretty sketch to me. Yep. And we move. Look, How many lockpicks do I have? Um, actually, I have two. I mean, I should not be too worried about that right now. Or there's a regular chest, so I'm gonna open that. There we go. And I think we go over here and a giant sculpture. Wow. Hmm. Look at this. The infinite spring. A conglomerate work of art that the great director Manorame created with his own funds. These individuals must offer their ideas to the director for the rest of their lives. What the fuck? Those who cannot do so have no worth living? Damn. Hey, this is most likely about the plagiarism, right? Yeah. Damn it. What a phony geezer. In other words, his pupils are his property. He doesn't even qualify as an artist if this is true. He's stealing the ideas from talented students in exchange for securing their livelihood. Uh oh. He's a fraud. This even says that they have no rights. Couldn't this be about the abuse? Yeah. Matarame will keep them around as long as they're useful to him. The moment they're not, he's treating them like slaves or tools. He's a snake. 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 Why is Yusuke keeping quiet about this? He's got no reason to cover this up. I mean, he does owe his life to him. He did say that he owes Matarame his life for being taken in. That's exactly what I'm saying. But still. When we were at the exhibit, I praised one of the pieces on display. But Kitagawa Kun acted strange. Oh yeah, where he kind of boosted his ego. Maybe that piece was plagiarized too. Yeah. What's the call? Ain't this enough to target Matarame? Let's do this. Fuck it. That's what I'm talking about. Yes, sir. Hold yes, sir. Oh, sh oh, way to kill the vibe. Oh, Mor Oh, my name is Morgana. I always kill the good vibes. You're still a cute kitty, though. We should confirm these facts with you, Scape, once more. Yep. Confirm what, though? It means we should get solid evidence that such crimes actually took place. Yeah. I know, man. I want to jump into a new palace, bro. Besides, there's too much we don't know about Madarama yet. You, you're not wrong. Yep. Yep. 
Don't get. Whoo! I know you black, big, easy head ass is not thinking about something. You all better come with me, okay? Mm. True. I don't think we won't, considering our current level. Well, we'll just prep ourselves until we get confirmation from Yusuke. Ten four. This is our first mission as real phantom thieves. We're gonna succeed no matter what. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Man, I just love. I really love Ryuji's confidence, man. Whoo, man. Yes, sir. And we still got a new palace. Mm. All right. There's the reason Yusuke is high in the truth, huh? So, all right. So for now, we have retreated. So we're gonna try to get some more information. Um, I probably will hang out with on this episode because I forgot to start her confidant like a dum dum. <clears throat> but would you like to forgive someone unconditionally if you, if you owe your life to them? I'm not sure anymore. Why you're bringing this up for? According to Katago kun Monorame isn't a problem. I mean, is something wrong? Yeah, a little. I know Monorame is a bad person, but still. I may be so hesitant because I haven't actually met the victims. Well, there's that guy in Mementos, our first guy. Yeah, I guess that part is totally different from what happened to Kamishida. This might be in a string of lying and thinking, but if an evil person isn't causing trouble now, is it really the point of us stepping in? She does got a point. You do got a point. So if we're gonna let Yusuke decide Monorame is worth going after or not, I don't know. If it were for me, I will never forgive that bastard. Um, let's see how Yusuke feels. I guess we can talk to him some more after that. Let's meet some. Sh let's meet in Shibuya after school tomorrow. Yeah. Okay. Remove. Okay. Now what? Yo, Ryuji. I just can't forgive Monorame, but what on set made me think to Yusuke, are we just a bunch of thugs? Uh, no way, bro. Right? I mean, it kind of has me rub in the wrong way as well. Facts. Hell no, nah, bro. Bro, you're right, man, man. Yeah. And some of the shit, some of the shit happens in real life too. <laughs> oh. Ten four. I don't know how long I've been recording. Alright. Alright, I contacted Katagura Kun about modeling for him. Still waiting for his response. Thanks. I have really no idea what I'm supposed to do as an art model, though. Uh. Just be yourself? That's actually kind of hard. No, it's not. <laughs> Look, you ain't gonna go out all out for this. If you're gonna only get dirt on my mermaid, remember? Yeah, that's true. It sounds like Katago he wants to be a private picture of his, though. I guess I'll let you know when he contacts me again. <laughs> I guess until then, can we procrastinate?
Oh my god. Perfect. Probably dropped all his plans just to get you over there. We need to find out from Kitagawa kun if what we saw in the palace was true. Mm-hmm. Hey, fly down. It's that student council president. Oh Makoto. Bakana. Okay. Yeah, what? Don't you think Kitagawa kun has to be protecting Matarame? I mean, they live together, so he'd have to be aware of Matarame's true nature. The only reason I can think of him doing that is that Matarame has something on him. Yeah, that's weird. You're not wrong. That's why we're going to check it out, right? Ready to be a model? Yeah, I'm prepared. What do you mean prepared? Prepared for what? Something seems different about her to you. <laughs> oh, nice eye. I didn't cut them. Huh. Well, let's get going. Talk to you, Ken. Yeah. He talked about who seemed really happy when I agreed to be his model. Once he finishes drawing and gets a little friendlier. We should bring up Madarama. Then he will call us a bunch of frauds slandering me. Oh my god. Ah, dude. Just, 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 just calm down. Wouldn't you get nervous too? If it was just the two of us? We're here to keep an eye on you, so uh, don't try anything perverted, okay? Yeah, we're, we're going to have to jump you. Okay. Huh? Is there a problem? No, not really. Well, let's get started. This is gonna get funny real quick, I can tell. in the zone. He's in the zone, motherfucking zone. You hear him? This man is in the zone. <laughs> He's in the zone. He going in. <laughs> Go get him. We were gonna catch him off guard and make him spill his beans, weren't we? Yeah. Well, we should just know this was gonna happen. Yes. You might want to stay put. Just waiting around is a waste of time. This is too boring, so I'm going to scout around a bit. I hope he didn't get caught in 4K. It's weird how flashy that door is. Is that a lock? A door with a hefty lock. What could be in there? Okay. Oh, hell no! How many hours do you think you made us wait? How many hours did we buy? I'm, I actually want to know. I'm sorry. We had another reason for seeing you today. 
Mm hmm, son, you might as well just get talking. It's about those rumors regarding your sensei. Might want to get to talking, or. Just so good. In that painting I saw at the exhibit, you're the one who actually painted it, right? That's. I knew it. Your sensei seriously messed up. He just thinks of his pupils as tools. That's why he doesn't give a damn whether he steals their work or physically beats them. I'll make this clear. There's no point in hiding stuff from us. <laughs> I have no idea what you're talking about. You couldn't go against him, could you? I'm sure we can help you out, though. Stop it. It's just as you all say. We are our sensei's partner. Don't misunderstand me, though. Mm -hmm. I offered my ideas to him myself. As such, it can't be called plagiarism. Sensei is simply suffering from artist's block right now. Oh. Dude, still. He did, Alcon. Then why are you sticking around? All his other pupils ran away. Aren't you the only one left? Strong with a pupil helping out his master. There are no victims here. Stop pushing your self-centered righteousness on me. Are you okay with this, my guy? I'm supporting Sensei as his pupil. Where's the wrong in that? Don't ever come here again. If you do, I'll sue you for causing a disturbance. We're not done talking here. Not worth it. Hey, I'm reporting you to the police. I asked Hakamaki-san to be my model today, but I don't recall ever calling you two here. Uh, well, Ryuji, we're gonna have to do it to him. What did he say? What? Nude? <laughs> uh, to think I'd be able to create a new painting with my most ideal model. Of course, you two won't be allowed in, and I ask that you forget about our discussion today as well. If I don't submit a new piece to Sensei soon, there will be some inconveniences. She flushed Let's go.
Shut up. The way he said it, it's not going to be semi, but full on. Full nudity? Lady Yon's gonna. Yep. Yeah. Anyways, we gotta go after this guy. Madarame is the kind of target we've been waiting for. Yep. Let's help Yusuke come to his senses too. Before he ends up like this. Right. I said a little bit of force sent shadowing, but that's just me. We need to look into Madarame first. There might be tons more stuff that hasn't been exposed yet too. Yeah. It may become easier for us to investigate his palace if he's preoccupied with his exhibit. Mm hmm Also, there's the thing about me modeling. I don't care. Tadokun said there'd be inconveniences unless he submits a new piece. Maybe that's going to be announced soon as Madarame's next work. Does that mean the whole country's gonna see you nude? Probably. <laughs> <laughs> we must deal with Madarame, no matter what, before his exhibit ends. Let's start after school tomorrow. Yep. Oh, it'll be a pain if Miss President finds us on the rooftop again, so... Uh, where do we end? Let's see... Well, I guess that walkway-like place in Shibuya would work. It's near Madarame's place, too. Yeah. Changing our hideout periodically, huh? That's a plan I don't mind back. And our hideouts at the SS way. Hey, can I talk to you kids for a sec? Who the hell are you? Huh? From the looks of things, you don't seem like the ordinary stalking fans. Uh oh, sorry, I should have been more clear. I'm actually looking for people that know Madarame's pupils. There's this painting, Sayuri, that was supposedly stolen in the past. Mm-hmm, you're on to something, lady. It was taken by one of his pupils in retaliation for being accused. Have you heard anything about that? Uh, Ryuji knows. Me? <laughs> I don't know nothing. <laughs> I see. There's no case unless there's a victim, and if there's no proof of abuse, I can't write either. Welcome back to square one. Sorry for taking your time. I'm a journalist. If you ever get any leads, mind contacting me here? Sure. See you then. I guess we should go home for today. Ten four. Oh man. I'm not sure how cutscene heavy this episode was, but whatever. I still can't forgive him. Demanding Lady on to paint nude. <laughs> and then claiming to report us to police. Oh my god. <laughs> hey, it's me. Got a minute? I have some interesting news. What? Someone who received a change of heart contacted me on the fan site. So uh-huh. Mm -hmm. 
another change of heart. Okay. Yup, it's that same guy we fought in Momentos. Who's Gookie's? Oh my god. I just found out something they're saying about Monorame. It seems like one of the stu a student has off robbed you couldn't speak up to him about Monorame stealing his work. Is that true? That generalist was looking into Monorame too. It could be real. Someone died though. No one's gonna talk about it. I bet it was all covered up. I wonder if Tagura kun has heard anything. It would be a great help if you c can help us. I ain't asking a bit much. After today, he's pretty. He's gonna be on edge about us. Anyway, Monorame is still a piece of crap, and I don't blame you. Let's meet up tomorrow. It will be the first time at our new hideout. It's that passageway in Shibuya, right? See you guys tomorrow. If the rumor Ryuji just spoke of is true, there have to be other victims. Yeah, I'm probably gonna end this episode right here, guys. If you did enjoy this episode of Persona 5 Royal, be sure to hit that like button, comment, and subscribe if all the notifications on so you don't miss another Persona 5 Royal episode and any of my uploads that I upload in the future. And yeah, this is your boy Tavoris Champion Plays. So peace out. Catch you guys later. Keep getting amazing. Positive advice only. Peace.